Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to episode 14 of Let's Play Elder Scrolls Online. And uh, here we are. Uh, found another questing little hub over here it looks like. Uh, the South Beacon. And uh, I guess it's maybe a lighthouse of some sort? or No, this is like South Beacon right here. I'm not quite sure what that means. What type of beacon are you guys using here? Anyways, uh, I thought we'd grab the quest around here. Ooh, look at this. Something to mine. I notice mining and things like that is a lot harder now. I can't find any ores anywhere, but I'm probably just blind. Um, but let's go ahead and grab this quest here. They came from no By the boat, no huh? I can make it back to the Valhill Guard. So prison there, huh? Okay. These bad guys? Yes, they are. Sea vipers. Every time they said sea vipers, I thought it was like snakes or something. Might be time to look at some of our skills too. We got seven skill points sitting here now. Uh, we got some morphing abilities. I knocked on morph anything. I know I should, but I've been waiting on uh, morphing to learn a bit more about that. And I still need to do more research on that, so I do apologize. Increase weapon and spell damage. Your equipment's damage. Okay, thank you for that. That's maybe what that noise was before. I increase your spell damage, uh, weapon and spell damage while invisible or stealth for 5% successful stealth, stealth uh, attack stun for 100% longer. Huh. And I'm, I'm assuming that works for every skill when you're stealth. Now, hidden or stealth? That's the question. Let's hope that means when I crouch down and- Oh, what the frick? Because this is considered hide, right? Hidden, yeah. I assume that's stealth too. Oh, key nine. Thank you, Chimney. That is something I'm going to look at right now. Craft. So, my buddy here says, if I go to blacksmithing, I can unlock this thing called key nine. Key, keen eye ore. Uh, in the world, be easier to see when you are 20% meters closer. Oh, that is badass. That, to me, is really important. Uh, especially since I like gathering, and I, I know that's probably one way to make money, is selling those stacks of that later on. Um, provisioning... Enchanting, uh, blacksmithing, we got the key 9 for that. Uh, woodworking, there we go. Here's the key 9 for it as well. Beautiful. <laughs> Lumberjack hireling, hireling, hireling. Yeah, we'll do it by hand for now. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, we're looking at passives. Somebody told me that passives are the best things in this game that you should always try to unlock. It'll help you a lot while leveling, so. Increases uh, potion effectiveness by 15%. Well, I'll do it. I don't use potions, though. I probably should, though. Uh, weapon, dual bow. New, new passive there. We got some new... Uh, oh, here's one. I know I can unlock volley. I just don't see any use for volley for myself yet. Deals 34 physical damage to the target. Knocks them back 6 meters and disorients them for... Ooh, that, I think, is an actual good ability. And there you go. It's on my hotbar. Perfect. I don't have this one yet. What is that under? Racial, I think. Maybe? I don't know what this is. R... Oh, look at this. This is a uh, passive. Resist poison and disease uh, resistance by 75. Increase maximum stamina by... Huh. That's pretty cool. Just a racial one. Uh, we got the fighter guild ones. We got the mage guild. All their passives for now are fine. I'm not going to touch any of this yet. Uh, soul magic. Soul trap. Active abilities. Wait, does that go in the bar? Oh... So if I keep it on the bar, I'll level it up. 
When a soul ability slot, uh, do 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 do, soul summon, soul lock, weapon kills have 5% chance to automatically trap souls. As far as I know, that's something I need. Because somebody told me over time, this is what you need to fill up the soul gems again once you've emptied them on your enchant. So I think I'll put that on my bar to unlock that over time. And then medium armor. This is really good stuff. I'm going to leave it now. I want to keep my tool points. Yeah, passives are very important, specifically your racial passive, class passive, and weapon passive for your weapon use. So I should have probably looked at those rather than the other ones, but I don't have anything here yet. Oh, this is dual wield. Derp. Oh, I actually have these all unlocked anyways. Next upgrade. And uh, You said armor, didn't you? No, you didn't actually say armor. I think armor is really good though for the medium armor because look at this, two percent, uh, oh one percent per, uh, per uh, piece of medium armor. Oh, <gasps> oh! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Must attack. Must attack. Aha. Oh no, I can't get to that one. Wonder if what happens if everyone teams up to not activate those things? Would they just keep spawning over and over? Mine, Your woman. soul is mine. I own you. Come, let us play. Play we shall, my friend. Yes, I want to be the one to close it. I want to be the one to close it. Get away! Get away! I want to be the one. I want to be the one. I'm gonna sit here till I'm the one. Doing these when events. Your soul will be mine. No! I swear, it looks like the same guy from last time, too. I can't see anything, Mama. There you go. Well, I got two greens out of that. Oh, I didn't get to watch it blow up. You guys think I'm probably sad that I keep going and doing that event. We gotta get far enough so we don't hear it anymore so I don't go running like a dog to it. It's like, squirrel! I really like doing it. I'll help you. Where are you? Wait, was that something I was supposed to loot last time and I never looted? Oh, it's a new bow too. Huh. Not probably something worth damage wise, but no. These guys are level 5, so yeah, of course they wouldn't be dropping anything my level now. Do I have a better weapon on me right now? Yeah. I think it's time to switch up just a bit. Whoa, it's on fire. I think it's good to switch up weapons once in a while, level other things too. I think people say that all the time too, they recommend it. And mainly because this one does okay damage and these are low levels, so it's like... Oop, let me lift my microphone up. Oh. So hopefully that wasn't annoying sounding. Let's 
kind of sad, but the skill I always spam anyways is the uh, one I can use with anything. This one spell, I swear, is the best one in the game right now for me. It uses Magicka, unfortunately, but deals 63 magic damage and heals the player for 24% of the damage inflicted uh, every 2.0 seconds for 10 seconds. The heal is nice, but the amount of damage you can use and spam it, like, I'll show you guys. Look at this. Watch this. Like, to me, it's like a badass move that just owns them. Where my other one, sadly my bow one, uses stamina. It's like a dot damage that's really slow and lame. It's like, not as exciting as that one. Well met, stranger. As you may have noticed, I'm not at liberty to stab. Um, I would actually say, honestly, I would say no. I keep saying people, do, yes, I came back to ESO because of uh, the buy to play. But I've been actually looking to play it for a few days now. In fact, I told my friend about it uh, a couple of days ago saying, hey, I was looking into maybe playing that or Lord of the Rings Online and uh, or uh, Rift or whatever. And I just I decided I wanted to play ESO because I thought it was a good game. I know it started with a lot of bugs, but uh, the main reason I left was because my friends that I used to play games a lot with had left me and abandoned me. And I, I kind of gave up. Um, if you check my friends list here, these were some of the friends. I don't, not all of them are on here, but uh, you can see some of them were not really high level. I think I was 21 or 22 uh, on my original character. Um, but yeah, they all abandoned me, so I gave up, sadly. But hopefully I'll make new friends now. And there's a lot of cool people, so... I wanted to charge my weapon. Yeah, your barrier doesn't walk when I walk the other side, does it? Okay, so what are we doing here? Um, oh, we got somebody over here to get. Didn't expect to see a friend. Never better. Completed. There we go. Get one over here, huh? Thank you. Well, if you could just vanish, why didn't you vanish before you got captured? <laughs> I like how he starts casting her his like heavy attack, and it's like, nope. Okay. I am, my friend, actually not a Templar. I might look like a Templar because I'm using two hands, a lot of heavy armor, but the funny thing is here, I am, uh, I forget what I am now. Why, why, why doesn't it tell me what I am? I'm a Nightblade, a Wood Elf. I usually use bows, but this is the cool part about this game. You can be anything and play anything. Blocking, interrupting, yes. Um... I know that you can interrupt. It tells me to use both mouse keys, I think, to interrupt. And if you block when they're doing a power attack, they get stunned for a second or two. And if you get stunned, you can hit both of your keys. No, you dodge out, I think. And you can get out of the stun, I think. But I do apologize. I'm still really new. You can see I'm just running away from my quest giver now because I'm enjoying the view of the world. Oh, there might be a storm coming. Oh, and what race am I? I am, uh, friggin' elf people. Uh, wood elf. I should probably answer the questions in detail. Hello, Captain. Tildur, the lighthouse keeper, was spared. I did the lighthouse is solid stone, but even stone can burn with the right mixture of kin. Tildur says the Maormer placed a magical ward on the lighthouse door. We haven't much time. Then do it quickly. We're running out of time. Okay. So we're gonna go. Hmm. 
There's two collecting. Huh. Let's go this way first. Uh, take a picture of this if you don't mind. You can hit print screen and paint it, uh, and then control V and paint. But I use Awesome Guild Store, uh, Domes, Data, Dedra, uh, Shopkeeper, uh, Dustman's Disabled. I had some issues with that. Foundry Tactical Combat, Inventory Grid View, Item Saver, Loot Drops, Lore Books, Lost Treasures, Minimap, Research Assistants, Sky Shards, Quest Tracker, and Toolbar. I'm a very new player at this, but I basically looked at what I liked and saw that was really cool, and I just basically created a list. I really should actually put that on a post or something, because a lot of people ask me about that every day, so. And maybe I'll link to them and stuff for others to uh, get later on. Uh, create. Okay, so... Uh, we're gonna go this way now. I really love the graphics in this game though, it's just so pretty. So pretty. So that keen eye, like how does the keen eye work? Will it just glow, I guess, uh, iron ore and stuff like that when I'm near it? I'm assuming something like that. Ow. Hey, you do a power attack on me. Oh yeah, here he goes. <laughs> Stunned, eh? Okay, let's see what we got here. Nice. Okay, let's see what we have. Uh, it's up here. Uh, yes, it glows after a certain range to it. Yeah, the more points you put in Keen Eye and the further away you can see it. Okay. Will you see it through objects, like, say, through this hill? Or do you have to actually have it in a somewhat physical view dis or viewing range or viewing whatever? I just want to know if you can see it through objects mainly. Well, that guy doesn't want to aggro me. That's good. So this thing I put on my bar here, Soul Trap 3, deals 50 magical damage over 10 seconds to the target and fills a soul gem if the target... Oh! Ha! You know, I, funny, I think I actually have a soul gem, didn't I? Uh... Hey, hey! Why did the PC version of the interface let me search for this stuff, but you can't search on this? They need to fix that. Should have a search button. There you go. Ah uh -huh. So did we fill the soul gem, I wonder, or nope. Oh! Well, that happened. <laughs> if I had blocked that attack, I wouldn't have fell to my ass. <gasps> yes, we're just in time. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you tighten that anchor.
Oh, an add-on for searching? That's awesome. It's mine, it's mine, it's mine! I lost like all my viewers after watching me do this the hundredth time. Oh, 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 it's mine, it's mine, mine. No, get away from that. No. Must guard this one with my life then. Yes, I got it. The soulless one thinks I can be defeated. Not so. I actually have four souls in my inventory. Though I do have an empty one. Maybe he's talking about my empty vials. Holy crap, this one's big. He seems a little tougher than the last time. Yeah. Come on, King. This one's mine. Yes, I got it. Oh yeah, let's watch it disappear. <laughs> Ooh, another empty soul gem. Okay, back to uh, <laughs> our quest. Kick the ass of the guy who kicked my ass off the ship. Leg literally kicked my ass off the ship. Ow, 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 ow. Good girl. Too bad I won't get this pretty horse anymore once I have to get that other one. Okay, we'll put you away for now. Oh yeah, I want to go back to that cool weapon I was playing around with. I like the change of weapons. Yeah. Good morning, I got a gift for you. Oh crap. Oh, I thought he was doing like a long attack. We're going back up to kick this guy's ass. Hey buddy, you remember me? Yeah, not this time. This should start, uh, you should start feeding this horse. They are changing the way mounts work in 1.6. Oh, so I don't need to buy the, uh, the 25% or whatever the hell the, the other mount is. See, I was, everyone told me not to bother with this one because, uh, the other mount would be better. Ow! Jeez. Oh yeah, I didn't get to use my ability. I want to use you. Oops, I hit four instead of five. So I wonder if my soul gem got filled up at all there. Hmm. 
it's not filling up. Well, it says 50% chance or something, so... Wait, am I supposed to get something down there? I'm pretty sure it was. Aha, here it is. Fire salts. Uh, you will still buy it, but the riding skill will be uh, independent of the mount. Oh, it's about time they did that. That makes a lot more sense. Well then, we will start working on that. I mean, it'll suck though because I might get to a level where I'll be able to buy the other mount, but I guess we'll have to just wait a while. I don't think that patch is going to come out for, what, two months at least? PTR I hear is coming out in the next few days, maybe next like Tuesday or Wednesday, I don't know. I heard it's coming out soon. Okay, we're supposed to go on this side, okay. We should talk. The Malmer are making their move. Oh, you're talking about me, huh? I thought you were having a spine on a conversation here. The Malamer. Simple. Ooh, I want that ability. These people don't have any literature to read. It's so boring. March 17th? Oh, no, no, no. Um, we're talking about when the patch comes out. Um, actually, maybe they would do the same patch. Would they do that at the same time? Would they release the uh, the 1.6 patch at the same time as the bit buy to play? Or would you think that'd be a separate patch, like 1.61 or something? Okay, so we're going over here, aren't we? Yeah. Up that puppy. How the hell am I going to even get up there? I feel like this was a dock towards that way. Well, console release will be a couple months later. Uh, console's on June. That's dumb though. I mean, I, I I work on a game called Stardale and I work on a bunch of community sites too and stuff like that, but I honestly, from my experience of MMO gaming for, oh god, it has to be over 15 years now. I'm almost 30, so that gives you an idea. I've been doing this stuff since a kid. Um, putting a major patch like 1.6 and releasing it the same time they go buy to play on PC is, that's just dumb. That's that's just ridiculous. From they're gonna have so many problems. I mean, the patch is gonna have bugs and issues. Plus, they're gonna have stability issues because of so many people coming back, anyways. That they're they're kind of like, on purposely, gonna cause themselves some problems. And it just it seems very silly. Like that's not a good corporate design. In fact, if it was me, I would get 1.6 out even before. Um, uh, so that's March, uh, January, February, March. I would get it out before even February 17th because I can guarantee you a lot of people will come back to the game uh, February 17th because they'll get their free month from the game box and then they'll play from there. And uh, then they'll be able to uh, get the free month and then they're buy to play or whatever after that. So. Yeah. But hey, it's their game. Whatever. They've already disappointed like a million players already today with their announcement of that they're not going to release any new updates. Uh, shit, I think I broke this accidentally. Oh, no, never mind. There was a different target spot. Uh, about their announcement that there's going to be no new content till after the console. 
version, which everyone is flipping out right now. They're pretty frightened by that because the whole thing is that like everything's going well for them, so people thought there'd be more content coming in. So for me, it's not a big deal because I'm a new player. I got lots of content for myself to keep me going for many months. But I, I don't blame people who've been playing this game since launch that are like kind of sad right now. Whoa! Hi. 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 Hey, friend. Over there. Hey. Over there. Hey. 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 Ah, screw you. I'll go in here like a man and die like a man. You're mine! Oh, never mind. I didn't have problems. Oh! Oh, I thought I blocked that. See, I didn't even need that. Uh, the no, the new release is 1.6, which is, I guess quote-unquote can be new content, but I think majorly it's balancing than anything. But I don't know a lot, so... I just read a lot of what people say and how they feel and stuff like that. I'm happy with everything, but... I see it! The, the tower is on fire! How did this happen? I think I better get out of here. This invasion is... We'll head to both. Thank you. Where is it? Can I watch the tower? Aww, we don't get to watch it on fire. I thought it would stay on fire for us. That wouldn't be pretty though if you went around in the game and destroyed everything and it would just be on fire all the time. Okay guys, on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and all that fun stuff. and we'll.